Daisy's walk on the small side. There! Hey guys, my latest and greatest invention is ready! Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I'm excited to see it! You've been keeping it a secret all morning. The Shrinker 9000. Ooh. A tool that can shrink things down and size them back up with a simple zap. Ooh. Let's try it out. I'll take this tin can to the testing area and... Hey, my can! That seagull loves shiny things. <laughs> Good thing I have backup empty tin cans. They're in the bin. Can you guys get them for me? <laughs> Come on, Ruby. Let's go finish setting up the testing area. We'll line up the cans along this beam and zap them. Bites, <laughs> <laughs> <Wait>, careful! <laughs> How do we get big again? The Shrinker 9000. But it's way over there. We have to walk to the Shrinker, and that'll take weeks. <laughs> that sounds like the bits. They must be coming back with the tin cans. Which means they're headed here, to the testing area. Maybe they can help us get to the Shrinker 9000. Bits, we shrunk. Bits, come in. It's not working. Our devices are too small now. We're gonna have to get their attention the old-fashioned way. Hey, Daddy! Hey! Help, Daddy! Daddy! Hey, hey. <laughs> Wait! Get off! Hey, Daddy! Okay, that didn't work. They can't see us or hear us. Then we need to go higher. Let's climb the junk pile and hope someone will see us up there. Great idea! Let's race! Last one to the top is a bent antenna! <laughs> oh, my screwdriver! I've been looking for that. a climb up a junk pile could be. We must be high enough for someone to see us now. Or not. And with feet this tiny, it'll take forever to reach the top. Oh, I know what to do. We can build a catapult and launch ourselves to the top of the junk pile. Super fast. Great idea. And fun, too. Help me look for parts. Perfect. Will give us some string. And we can sit in this spoon. Add some string for slingshot action, and we have our ticket to the top. Gotta say, I never thought I'd be flung into the air by a spoon catapult. <laughs> this day just gets weirder and weirder. Isn't it awesome? Three, two, one, spoonapult! <laughs> I hope we land on something soft. Oh. Ah! Whew! Thank goodness! We landed on Mr. Wobblesworth! <laughs> We're definitely high enough now! Rusty! Ruby! Look! It's Liam! I got a new ball and it really wants to play catch! Liam! Liam! Right here! Liam! Yeah! Rusty! Ruby! Where are you? Oh, Liam! We may be higher, but we're still too small to be heard. If no one can hear us or see us, we might be super small forever. Where are you? Rusty, Ruby. Where are you? We're up here! Liam! Help! There's no way Liam is going to hear us from down there. 
And we still have to get to the Shrinker 9000. Somehow. Wait. I have an idea. Maybe we can get Liam's attention another way, with things we find in the junk pile. This coin! We can shine it at him, but it's kind of small. Oh! How about we shine it into that tin can and light the whole can up? Yeah! He'll see that for sure. Help me lift the coin onto the screw. <laughs> Then we can fly all the way to the Shrinker 9000. That's it! Look at all this stuff! We can make something that can fly us to the Shrinker 9000. Yeah, we may be tiny, but our ideas are still big. Let's combine it and design it! We'll start with this lid. We can use it as our cockpit. Then we'll add popsicle stick wings. And make them flap with rubber band power. Put it all together, and we've got our plan. <laughs> Modified. <laughs> Customized. Rustified. Parts Pile Plane 9000. Time to get cranking. <laughs> we'll get to the shrink ray in no time. Let me see if the magic light will give you a lucky coin too, Ralph. Okay. And I'll keep it for you. In my pocket, of course. Okay. <laughs> Looking birdie. Ah! Prepare for landing, Captain Ruby. Call me that, Captain Rusty. Lean left. Yeah. Now right. Yeah. <laughs> the seagull is back. It must be looking for more shiny things. Rusty, tiny high five. I'll zap you first. That 
was a big success. <laughs> I have so many questions. We've got a pretty tall tale to tell you about two tiny friends. Once we lock up the Shrinker 9000. That's awesome! Ooh, ooh, and I have great stories to tell, too. I got a lucky coin from a magic light! <laughs> yeah, about that magic light. <laughs> <laughs> I don't get it. Liam gets bird napped. One, two, three, go! Look at my flappy flyer go! Woohoo! Cool! Yeah, and my long winged express went super far. Whoa! Whoa! That deserved a double whoa! That was awesome! Squirt! 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 Liam here! <laughs> Reporting for flying practice. Oh, um, it's airplane flying practice, Liam. Oops, doesn't matter. I like being a bird. I've always wanted to fly. Squawk! 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 Whoa, that's a really good bird costume. That's a real bird, Liam. And it's giant. Squawk! 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 be looking for something. She looks just like me. Wait, Liam, you don't know that bird. I'll introduce myself. I'm pretty sure I can speak bird. Squawk, 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 I think she likes me. <laughs> I can fly! Whee! A giant bird took Liam. He seems to like it. But a giant bird took Liam! Come on! Awesome! Ooh, comfy. Thanks, Mrs. Bird. <whistles> Mr. Bird? <whistles> Mama? <whistles> Squawk, squawk, squawk! Oh, yeah. She must think Liam is a baby bird. She might be the best bird mama in the entire world. But Liam is not a baby bird. We better get him back. Time to bolt. to do, we'll get the mama to leave the nest. Then, when she's gone, we'll rescue Liam. But how can we get her to leave the nest? With another kind of worm. A flying worm. Time to go mobile. Perfect. A remote control, motorized, rustified kite with a fake worm attached to it. 
I'll get the mama bird to fly away from the nest. You rescue Liam. Will do. Whoa! I didn't know worms could fly kites. and her nest is hard to reach. Saving Liam is gonna be harder than we thought. I know what to do. We have a friend who's super fast and a great climber, and she might be able to rescue Liam. Tigerbot, great idea, Ruby. Tigerbot, we need you. <laughs> Mode. I'm getting really hungry. I should probably go home pretty soon. You're doing great. Just get us close, then we'll grab Liam. <sighs> hey, Tiger Bot! Yahoo! My friend Tiger Bot is Liam! looking rock. Whoa! Oh, um, thanks, but I don't want to jump off a cliff. I can't fly, but I am good at checkers. She's trying to teach him how to fly by pushing him off the ledge. We need to get him away from that mama bird. But she's so fast and so good at flying. Hmm, then we need to be fast too. And we need to fly. Let's combine it and design it. We need wings so we can fly like a bird. Then we'll add jets so we can fly super fast. And last but not least, special flying helmets. Put it all together and we've got our plan. Bird 
looks so sad. Aw, she really does. She thinks we're taking her baby, Rusty. Let's show her that Liam's a boy, not a bird. Then she won't be so sad. <laughs> Mrs. Mama Bird, this is Liam. He's a kid, not a bird. Yep. <laughs> I need to go home and do kid things. But I can visit and we can do bird things, which are really fun, except the worms and the cliff thing. <coughs> Something's wrong. She's looking for something, like she was doing when we first met her. Hmm, I wonder. Hey, that wasn't a rock! Did you lose an egg? <coughs> I'll be right back. Yep, that's her egg. It must have rolled down the mountain. Aw, she's gonna be a great mama. I think she's saying thank you. That means you're welcome. Maybe. We've got awesome flying machines now. So, wanna fly? Let's do it. <laughs> yeah! <laughs> <Yes>. <laughs> Whoa! 